This is where I have got to at the end of uh, what I think is now my sixth session on working John Smith's Busker plans. I've made my complete set of pipes. All the pieces are now ready. The pipes are completed and you can see the uh, caps of the pipe and uh, what's referred to as the upper lips of the pipe have all been prepared and they're attached to the pipe at the moment with rubber bands waiting for the uh, voicing on uh, one of the larger lower pipes you can see the separate pieces the pipe with its uh, hole in the wind chamber um, the uh, shelf of the pipe the uh, cap of the pipe and the gasket which goes under the cap and then the upper lip which I have uh, and made from hardwood from mahogany and I have uh, chamfered it ready for uh, the completed pipe and I've actually tested this pipe and sounded uh, the pipe and it sounds it sounds good I'm pleased with the sound so far I'm not going to record the sound of it playing yet I will record the sound of the organ when the whole thing is complete from a technical point of view, I found this miniature circular saw an absolute boon for cutting the strips and cutting the caps and uh, the uh, upper lips of my pipes. It's been extremely uh, useful and uh, the other piece of equipment I guess I couldn't have managed uh, without is more or less next door and that's my miniature drill to which I have uh, a flat working table that turns it into a, a working uh, router top with a security guard and this has been uh, used for making the neat uh, profiled edge to the lips and uh, caps and the next project will be to chamfer the pieces and I'm not quite sure how to go about this but I think what I'm going to do is to build a box for my band sander to go into and then a jig so that I can slide each piece down onto the onto the belt in order to give it a neat chamfer so that each pipe looks as it has the same angle reflects light in the same way I think that will make the whole thing look a bit uh, neater but uh, for the moment I'm very pleased to have uh, my set of pipes more or less uh, completed and you can see from the rest of the film the workshop's a bit of a shambles and so now I'm going to take stock tidy up uh, and get back to work again in a few days time once the workshops uh, uh, hoovered, dust freed and uh, reorganised.